go. So I'm going to abuse the Federation and just turn it into my own personal anti-piracy force. <laughs> That's pretty typical. Not not going to deploy the uh, the Federation fleet to take out this uh, this asteroid that's uh, about to uh, blow up one of Zerfall's planets. No, it's about no? to do what now? Exactly. Sorry, I, wasn't, I wasn't paying attention. This uh, you have some use you want for the Federation fleet other than taking care of my personal piracy problems? No, oh no, of course not. Why would we want something like that? Yeah, I see. I'm not even not even tracking with that. <laughs> Ancient mining drones. Ancient mining drones. <laughs> Ancient mining drone secret. Uh -huh. oh, I was about to go there, but I thought no. <laughs> Too silly. Gingen style. Sorry, I'm doing something in the Guinean system, which causes me to say a different word entirely. <laughs> well, I guess I'll start moving my actual offensive navy back towards the war garbles. Although I should double check and make sure that their strength is like considered pathetic before I just assume I can beat them up. I'm, I'm riding high on a victory from several videos ago, where suddenly I'm like, "No one can touch me." <laughs> well, you you might also want to uh, warn us and and let us uh, get involved. Yeah, that's true. Right. Or Federation, I should probably. They I'm have equivalent fleet power, and they're like pathetic at everything else, so I really shouldn't just assume I can beat them up without getting some more stuff going. That being well, said. I mean, they may also invade our system, so... Well, I mean, yeah, but... Who cares about that, right? Yeah, pretty much. Actually, it'll be time to start selling food in order to buy uh, alloys if I want to really start going on a spending spree. First League Headquarters. I get 9,999 uh, 9, Unity, 500 Society Research, and 151 Influence. Fascinating. Fascinating. Oh, here my fleet goes. Pew, pew, pew. How long is this asteroid going to last? It blew up. It blew up real good. Oh, and that was the planet where uh... apes evolved from men. Yeah, <laughs> it was actually the place with uh, the. Oh, I gotta. Oh, these minerals are full. I gotta convert minerals faster. Yeah, I just sold ten thousand. You're tanking the market. I know. I heard you talking about it. I'm like, mm, better, better, better sell those fast. All right, so you're going to be at war with the war bar Blargle and I mean, not not immediately, Gilgros. right? But that's that's who you're going to be. Against. That's who I'm making claims against. Yes. Okay, I will go head down to the Beldros uh, border. Just so that I'm ready. Those jerks. They're, they're selling my peeps. I'm telling you, you should murder them. How, 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 how? Should upgrade that system as well. Ooh, the free Bruggen something. I'm Zay and aliens, eh? Encountering the soul system, which I guess means they oh. communicated with me electronically, but. I have a uh, wormhole border to uh, the Elamir system where the automated dreadnought is. Oh, cool. Let me know when you want to take that out. That might be a while, though. Yeah, a little while. Hey man, crystalline entities. Fascinating creatures. We can learn to coexist. Tear them apart. No, we're nice. You might be nice, I'm not. No, oh, well, get out of my federation, meanie. <laughs> Oh, 
How do I move just a couple ships into another... Uh... Split them off and then merge them up. Uh, you might also want to double check your fleet manager, make sure that they're... You're not, like, building in, you know, the wrong ships into it or something like that. Oh. Vanath, nutritional slurry is not people. The ingredients are secret and very healthy. Show us your wares. <laughs> uh, they are mm, selling slurry. four specialist pops. Yeah, you can sell sell some of your own humans into slavery, right? They're sell they're selling me bunk beds. <laughs> Let's see, where are no that's not what I want. Where are my other good uh sciencey worlds? There we go. Uh I got advanced Corvette hulls, that's good. All right, the Ecumenopolis is going to be colonized. That's always a good feeling. It is. Oh god, the Nagyari are, are decadent. Ew. Ew, and deviants. Ew. Yuck. Mm-hmm. Yuck. Disgusting. Uh, what do we want in this world? What does this world have to offer? I actually have not gotten any of the, uh... Like, the research upgrade buildings yet. It's kind of annoying. Hey, it gets road distillation, though. Without research upgrades, your research will never be complete. Let's see. I'm only getting 14 Empire Sprawl from branch offices right now, so I imagine that uh, the other thing would be better at the moment. I'm actually pretty close to having enough influence to reform my government. I may have enough influence to claim more systems from these jerks. No, I don't. I'm just going to claim the entire Warble Confederacy if, uh. <laughs> Resonant. I've made peace with the Crystalline Entities. So now Data's mom doesn't have to come. or the mom of some person who got killed. Doesn't have to supplant her son's personality into data or whatever happened on one TNG episode. <laughs> it's all it's all good. We do galactic campaigns. Gradually running out of things that are cheap to research that I actually feel like getting. It's very sad. Yeah. Yeah. That is uh, understandable. Uh, my fleet uh, is in position, so whenever you're ready, just let me know.
-hmm. Okay. I don't think it's happening during this particular session, but I do need to remember for next time that's what was happening. Because I, now I kind of want to build up my fleet a bit more. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure. You wait until I get my fleets in position and I'm spending all mm -hmm. kinds of my energy credits on that. Sure. Yeah, go for it. I did not mm -hmm. tell you to move your fleets, turtle. I thought it would take you longer to deploy <laughs> anyway. Your turtles. <laughs> Well, that's why we have spaceships. <laughs> that's why we needed to deploy early, because we knew it was going to take us a while to get there. Let's see. Put you guys together. Hmm. I have a total fleet. My fleet that I was going to use to attack has the strength of 6.3k. I don't think that's going to be enough to take all the systems I try to claim, though. Oh, hey, a league science-based after I've already found the first league. Yeah, getting the uh, getting access to this uh, um, extra space out here uh, it was, a, it was a pretty nice boon in that regard. I can only imagine. <laughs> now... On the other hand, uh, what is your what is your current uh, leader upkeep percentage at? Leader upkeep? Uh, where do I check this out? It's under Empire Sprawl. Oh, wait a second. I'm evading hostile fleets. Interesting, more aliens. Okay. We got half aliens. Where's Empire Sprawl? We got population colony systems. Right next to the uh, where you look at. Special resources. Oh, here it is. In. Um, leadership upkeep plus ninety-seven percent. Yeah, I'm up to plus three hundred percent. Well, you had it coming. <laughs> oh, I need to get new rivals because I lost one yep. of my rivals at some point. Uh. Everybody's either pathetic or overwhelming. I've got some inferiors. It's basically only the inferiors that you can do it with. Well, now the two equivalents are you guys. Well, yeah, but we're in the Federation. Right. Oh, we could always break the Federation. Just so like, I get an extra, an extra point per turn, yeah. Well, it would be a little bit more than that because you'd lose the 2.0 for uh, being in the Federation. Well, that's true. Uh, they already know these guys are already my rivals. <laughs> Good, the hive mind, but they actually like me. Who are my rivals? What did I? The machine I intelligence guys are already assholes. I will make them my rivals. And the Terrapins. I will make rivals out of people. And friendly rivals are like, you know, are always... <laughs> Beldrash, yeah, United that's, Kingdom. Yeah, that's pretty how it works. There's a war going on, friends. All right, 26 months to probe the void. I think we'll probe the void. I'm not going to crack open the alien box yet, though. If you know what I mean. If you knew what I did. Oh, boy. Oh, they've reveled us, but we haven't reveled them. I see. We don't obviously any reason to keep you locked out of our territory. Thanks, guys, who I don't really know who you are. Because you're really far away. <laughs> oh, sure, they're not that far away. They're they're right on the other end of the uh, Shazark interface. Oh, is that the Twaxeldar Imperium, the brown ones? Or uh, there's Spiderweb logo guys, whoever they are. Yeah. They don't like me. They're... Well, actually, they kind of like me, but 
It's not like their border's closed. They like me more than they did. They closed, they opened their border, but... I wonder if these guys have any worthwhile planets for me to... pop down on. Eh, 28. Might be good. How much would that cost? Oh, I got all sorts of cool void well, stuff. Yeah, void stuff. Void clouds or whatever they're called. I'm learning fascinating things from them. Oh, the Zaydan Commerce leader making friends with the Benighted Kingdom. Oh, time to go dump some uh, minerals again. <laughs> uh, hmm. I have sold 127,000 minerals so far. So we got inferior and uh, equivalent fleet power from our two enemies. And if it weren't for the fact that we're wrapping up this video soon, I don't, I don't know how many more we're doing, I would I'd be more inclined to start a war if it wasn't like, eh, let's just wait till next session. <laughs> I think we could do one more. If you can. Yeah, we probably could. <laughs> that sounds really committal. <laughs> yeah, I know. And it, also, I'm just thinking, well, the last the last war wasn't really, didn't take that long at all. Interdimensional trade decreases. Hopefully they will recover. Oh, these guys uh, that I was talking about, how they opened their borders to me, just closed their borders to me, so. And that hierarchy of war garble has closed their borders. Well, that's it. That means war for sure. You're going to close your borders to me? So I had a uh, rage virus uh, show up on one of my planets, but uh, don't worry, I've developed a vaccine. Okay. Woohoo! Claim some stuff before I uh, attack them. So three union, huh? Oh, six point six six more, and I can get a system that I really, I can take one of their, I can take their homeworld system. I can claim their homeworld system. <laughs> Whatever you want, turtles. Good, good. My plan proceeds apace. I mean, it's probably not going to last, but... I'm just waiting until I can actually claim the planet War Garble. Yes, I claimed going? War Garble. <laughs> I will probably need to build up some pretty significant forces before I'm going to pull that shit off. But if we win that war, they're basically broken as a power. Well, I got all kinds of stuff happening here. Oh, they just declared war on somebody else. The war garbles have just declared war on somebody else. This would be a great time to attack them. Uh, they're going to war against that little tiny rebel guy that appeared there. Oh. The, uh, the Klingons. Because they're evangelizing zealots. Yeah, I got, um... We need to build more zones on this planet. We have um, people with no place to live. Sazerothi. Where are the Sazerothi Union? Sazerothi. Oh, poop. poop. Another guy with cor that's corrupt again. Dang it. Don't be corrupt. Get out of here. You're intelligent, too. Smart enough not to play by society's rules. Not smart enough to not get fired, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, that's two different things you're talking about there. <laughs> Let's see. We are Secundus is almost uh, colonized. 
Perfect. Tomb World, habitability 100%. Also has crystalline caverns. Thanks, weird species. <laughs> exactly. I can probably f get rid of one of these precinct houses now that shit's calmed down on this planet, but as soon as I get rid of it, watch it all go to hell. Which uh, which planet? Wandering Nest. They were not not thrilled with. Uh, I think they were. I conquered them from somebody else, so they weren't yes. excited about that. Yeah. yeah but they finally do. realized that they're better off with us in human land. So who did the war gargles go to war with now? They are at war with the Quarver Bargle. The yeah, you could probably even <laughs> swap out both of those. Uh, well, I got a new uh, tradition to figure out. Do I want to do insider trading or secure shipping? Probably insider trading first. So <laughs> I'm using a lot of the market. Wait, what? Yep. Now it says I need one more turn. Uh, Because you gained a, a district or something and it bumped up the... Uh... Gotcha. Huzzah, that that seems like a great way to end the video man. right there. Yep, yep, it does, because I also just got gateway travel. Oh, nice. Yeah, let's, uh... Of course, it does take 2,500 uh, alloys. Eh, it's going to be a little while before I get that. Anyway, we'll see about uh, that next time. Bye, everybody. See you then, everyone. <laughs> Bye.